This is episode number 29 and I have been continuously uploading Minecraft videos for the past 28 days daily. Just think of it. I have been daily uploading videos man. For the continuously 28 days. This is episode number 29. So today is 29th day and tomorrow. Tomorrow will be the big day when I will finally complete my challenge. I never thought that I would be able to <laughs> complete this. Although one day is left but I am pretty much excited that I will be doing that. So thank you for being here. Thanks to the 6 subscribers who have subscribed me for 28 videos i want to thank you personally and you kind of motivated me i did not get much subscribers but it's okay because maybe my content needs so much improvement and all that but man i am so glad that how can i so much how can i be so much consistent oh man i really like that man i mean i most of the things which i have done in my life are freaking irregular you know intermittent they are not regular but something based me from inside there is something you know something consistent consistency type of uh, spirit inside me which is kind of making me more consistent and disciplined man i really love it although i think that much of the discipline which i have inside me or consistency can be attributed to the pain which i received uh, this year has been so much painful for me i was hit by uh, you know breakup type of thing in january and uh, since then i cried a lot man yeah have you ever thought that whenever you uh, are sad have you ever thought that as a man I, I'm especially talking about a man because I'm a man myself I got one nail just one nail just stabbed inside my foot if I'm using the correct language and it got inserted inside my foot and my eyes didn't even get better. I mean I was just laughing that <laughs> what the hell how the nail can go inside my foot and all that you know that punctured my foot and went inside and that was not a small nail that was like uh, mm, two to three centimeter long at least and I did not even even cry my uh, my eyes even didn't get wet all right i was laughing that oh my god i was slightly annoyed that now i will have to you know <laughs> walk weirdly but that was just fine but man after breakup i fucking cried for five days straight man i really i that was freaking painful i mean i cannot fathom it i cannot believe that uh, my my body got hurt my body got hurt and my blood got my blood was flowing when i was you know uh, punctured by the nail but man i did not even cry and my eyes didn't even get wet but after breakup man i cried for five freaking days so i think that uh, yeah breakups are not uh, that much uh, a lightweight thing and in some terms i think that they are more much much more than they are imagined to be painful at so i distanced myself from my friends i distanced myself from my family and all that i went into oblivion internally i just uh, focused on myself and i just uh, let the pain to burn right i burnt every day every night i just uh, I, I just let myself be whatever there is going to happen to me i let myself to be i was sad for a very long time like uh, in the february in march but slowly by slowly i started to recover and i did something to myself uh, yeah i started no fab if <laughs> to be clear i started no fab i started to be away from so those kind of videos you know adult videos and i did not act on anything like that and because of that man because of that uh, it was again very much painful i was already going through breakup and uh, i was alone and after that i stopped doing those kind of things so there is there was perfectly zero pleasure in my life i don't drink i don't go to parties because i don't have any friend as i said that i had distanced myself from so you know i was kind of burning day in and day out so just imagine you have zero source of pleasure you don't like instagram scrolling that much you don't have Facebook account, you don't have friends, and you have stopped masturbation, you have stopped, uh, you know, uh, being interacting with the society and all that, and you are just stuck inside your room. You know, I just burnt for so many days, for so many weeks, and slowly, 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 I became something else, man. Now I'm something I don't even <laughs> get the hold of. I mean, what the hell I am? I'm super disciplined right now. Just look at me, man. I, I don't have any subscribers, six subscribers aren't much, but i have been continuously uploading minecraft videos and simultaneously i have been enjoying it for the past 20
28 days daily if you look upon my upload schedule you will see that i have been uploading minecraft videos daily every day just think of it that how much disciplined i really am in these days in so many days past you know so many days past and i did not break my consistency there was once a time you know, there have been many times when i was so much tired and feeling low and all that but i still can started my microphone and still recorded my videos and uploaded that and each video takes at least one hour to edit and upload you know making thumbnails and uh, although there are <laughs> there isn't much in thumbnails going on but yeah editing voice putting them in the videos and all that and i have been continuously doing them for the past 28 days without any hope or expectation of gaining subscribers and this my friend this proves that i am kind of strong and uh, from inside i mean there are many many more people who are much better than me from inside and i'm not gonna <laughs> you know get egoistic on that topic but yeah i'm kind of okay i'm kind of consistent eh? consistent and thanks to the pain thanks to the pain which i just want me from inside i am something here thanks to that suffering thanks to those sleepless nights thanks to that depression and pain and all that now i have become something else <laughs> it's beyond <laughs> beyond human <laughs> it's not beyond human but i am something like i know slightly super sane from inside and i'm much strong you know i was talking about 30 day video upload continuous let me see how long i do i can go on with this kind of consistency and if you want a strength i don't think that you need to follow my path of life but uh, i think that uh, you should try to know who you are and what your you know main goal is that if you are trying to get something done you know if you are trying to get some kind of physical uh, you know attraction <laughs> attractive look or if you are trying to get some degree or whatever you skill you want to you know but see you can do that by discipline and discipline comes before you know a lot of pain i i, I was so in so much pain man i really i really cried for so many days and it got me thinking that even getting my foot punctured by a long nail and seeing my blood running through my feet and all that and so much pain could not get my eyes wet you know could not even get my eyes wet i did not cry but you know that could not moisten my eyes and the freaking breakup thing just broke me from inside and you no know, man it was really painful i have been alone all my life so you know uh, if i get uh, attracted to a girl and if she leaves me man that really hurts a lot it, it is that again oblivion of um, complete pain and loneliness and darkness and no one is there for you i don't have any friends my parents are a previous generation so they do won't understand me i know that and i am not kind of interested i do not tell my i do not keep on going telling people about my love life and stories i just keep it to personal life and personal space only i do not you know propagandize and advertise about my love journey so it was painful man really painful but uh, you know it sometimes sometimes uh, you get see more than what you expect. I am kind of strong, but uh, you know, I will also like to admit that I am kind of numb right now. I mean, yeah, I do not focus much on you know female uh, you know interaction and all that. I am kind of numb or dead from inside. I don't know what the hell is that, <laughs> but yeah, I'm. If if I speak that uh, what is my mental state that, uh, then I will admit that I am compared to earlier. I am kind of happy. I am kind of okay. It's a little bit melancholy, but uh, yeah, a little bit sadness will always be there as long as you're alive. all your desires wishes and pain will go away when you are going to die when you have died all right so yeah this kind of things will go on and uh, i don't know what the hell i'm going to put in the title for this video but uh, i wanted to let you know that uh, these kind of strength don't come easy right i mean you can be consistent but for me this was not easy i had to learn, i had to get the inner strength you know hard way by through the hard way so yeah this is it. and this is episode number 29 let's see if i can upload episode number 32 and that will complete my challenge and after that we will see what we can do so yeah thanks for being here i mean if you are still listening this is my small story and it's not uh, you know more happy ending type of story but yeah this is it is this is not a freaking movie that there is you know villain has been defeated by hero and you know heroine uh, lives happily ever after there is nothing like that this is the freaking reality life is not fair and all that so yeah do whatever you can so i will see you in the next episode thank you 